a um, amazing response from some of the people. Uh, we know most of our customers by name, or we know the faces, and uh, we know what they're buying. And um, I think that's that's really different because it's very personal for everybody. Have a nice day. You too. Thank you. how croissants are made, in our bakery anyway, cut into triangles and um, stacked nicely on top of each other to keep each other cold and then they um, are stretched a bit and rolled into the croissants shape. We should have about 27 layers that are rolled to about um, two and a half millimetres, three millimetres. Thick. So the even um, layers of butter and dough will make it to rise and um, be crisp on the outside and nice and moist on the inside. We're lucky in New Zealand to have um, amazing butter that we have. And you can really t taste it in the croissants, the, um, the taste of the butter. After we make them like this, they need to go in a proofer, what's um, just basically a warm 28 degree room for about an hour and a half, and they will puff up and double in size before they go into the oven. It's quite a, you know, crusty and chewy bread. One of those. We only wanted to make some sourdough bread for people. Never had an intention of making all the um, pastries and biscuits and tarts and cakes and pies. But that people have um, been asking us for more and more um, sweet treats and uh, hot food and that's how we started to develop the range. And they're selling well, that's true. <laughs> this is lemon curd. We're making lemon curd and chocolate tarts today. So they're gonna go into these shells and sit in the, in the fridge. And um, they can go off to some happy customers. The cut lets the dough rise beyond what it would without the cut. It gives a nice um, open interior and also um, yeah looks pleasing. Everything's done in here by hand by us. We try to source the best ingredients we have. We're still loving it. It's been over a year and we're still having fun 